Hey, it's April 17th. That makes it a Wednesday. This is the Roger Williams Media Minute. And today I wanted to talk to you about just doing it. A friend of mine, Melissa Shirowski, shout out, melissashirowski.com. Go check out the website. She's an amazing artist. She's a really cool person. And she emails me the other day because we uh, both share a serious addiction to drum and bass music. If you're not familiar with drum and bass, go Google it. Um, you'll find a whole bunch of it, but we like to, you know, exchange mixes with each other. We find mixes online, and so we share them with each other, and she asks me, hey, I'm thinking about starting a blog on this. What do you think about that? I'm like, absolutely. You should, you know, content is king. We've been over this before. Um, you know, you should absolutely write about what you have a passion for and, and just get it out there, especially with drum and bass, because more people need to understand that this is music. Anyway. I digress. So she didn't ask me, hey, should I use WordPress, Tumblr? What, what's the best platform? I remind her that we've already set her up a website at melissashirowski.com, once again, shameless plug. Um, and it's running WordPress and you can blog on it. And you know, what this goes back to is it doesn't matter what platform you're using, uh, just get your content out there on one hand, okay? Just do it. Uh, that's the important thing. Just start getting stuff out there, whether it's on YouTube or Facebook or WordPress.com or Tumblr, or you download WordPress.org and you set up your own uh, WordPress site on your own domain name, or you use anything else. There's Octopress and all these other things out there too that are more hip than WordPress now. Uh, but the bottom line is just start getting your stuff out there and who knows what's going to happen. Um, the, the internet allows you to do things before that you couldn't because the cost of the barrier entry, the cost of getting going and publishing stuff is almost zero. Okay, if you've got access to the internet, you're already surfing around, consuming all this content, you should start creating some, start giving back, start putting stuff back out there. Now, once again, this is a reminder for you spammers, don't spam. Put out something that you're passionate about, that's that's fun to you, uh, and if one other person finds it and is like, that's awesome, thank you so much, you've accomplished something, okay? Um, the next stage after that is starting to look at stop digital sharecropping. What I mean by that is putting your content on somebody else's domain name. Now, I'm putting this onto YouTube, so I'm a little bit of a hypocrite there, but hey, that's kind of par for the course. Uh, YouTube is free, and it turns out video takes up a lot of bandwidth, and I don't really want to pay for all that. So I use YouTube, um, and then you know post some stuff onto my website as well. That's a different story. Anything you're typing up, any text, you should look at getting that onto your own website at some point. Uh, but once again, this post is about just doing it, so get it done, write it now, put it out there, you know, do some grammar check, don't, you know, look like a total ignorant, but don't stress over it, you're not gonna put out war and peace, probably ever. But, you're gonna at least get your words out there and start making your impact and letting people know about what you're up to and sharing what you care about. So that's what I've got for you today, tomorrow's Thursday, by the way, Kate and I got a pop-up, there's the time lapse. Let me know what you think. Um, until then, rock and roll.